Well, the sog hasn't really had much love, so let's get cracking with something down here. <laughs> Welcome back to Steve's Tycoon Terminal. We're having a look around London today because I want London to be a, well, it's going to be a major city, of course, like in real life, but we're going to need to start adding some something in here to make it grow because at the moment London is quite small. So I've had a, a bit of a scout around and there are a few, we've got like a steel plant here, but there is an absence of. Uh, iron ore around here. Like I suppose we could bring it across. It's quite a long way. So that, that is a potential route that I'm going to use. But and then the issue if we use that is the machines are all the way over here. And to be fair that might be a shout to use this route but I was also iron up a little bit further away. We've got the, the uh, we've got a bit of a steel mill here and we can actually add like there's quite quite a few resources around it that we can kind of plumb into this uh, this steel mill so I am kind of swayed towards using this and having a rail route from here running down um, through the valley here and then you know curve its way into into London um, I'm still like a little bit cautious of it because I'm not really making mega bucks and I, I, as soon as you start doing a complex, we're, we're using multiple industries now. So we're taking the coal and the iron ore into the steel mill. And then we're taking the steel into the machines. And then we've also got to get the, the wood and the, uh, the planks to the, uh, the goods or the machines factory as well. And then obviously ferry all them down. I suppose the bonus if we do run that is we could technically run some carriages from this iron ore mine to here and then I don't because of the vehicle compatibility <laughs> it might be interesting trying to get the same material back up again because if, let's have a look where's my nearest depot last you built one there last time um oh, come on let me click on it no you're not yeah, there we go, buy vehicles, and yeah, so now this one will take everything, but that's a mod. But when it comes to the other materials, like really, we should be using like this carriage here, but that, that won't be bringing any steel back, it'll be wanting to use this one. Like I might just use the, um, the this mod to be fair, and just have have it uh, so it's taking something back up I don't know see what you guys think <laughs> you'd be like Steve what did you do that for you're an idiot but I I think that this will be a good a good good route to do so I'm probably going to make a start with with that today uh, I'm still unsure of where in which mill I should use. Like, should I use this one? Technically, yes, because then I'm taking more stuff. It's going to be running full more rather than using this one up here, which has more materials. Could use both. That's a bit of a curveball. So you'd use both, have a station at both of these. Um, Maybe that's something for later on, uh, and we, we, we plumb in the uh, the extra one later on. But anywho, let's. Uh, well, I don't know. Have I got enough money to start a project like this? Where are my boats? If I've got a boat coming in soon, then <laughs> you know I'll, I'll I'll get cracking. And also, how's my train doing? The one there. Have you arrived yet? Have you? Well, there's, there's nothing here. Have you been and gone already? How much stuff have you been? Oh, okay. You're, you, you're on the move. I forgot to set it to um, unlimited wait time, but that that's fair. That no, That's okay. We can let that go. Right. I think we've got enough 
gradually coming in that we can kind of make a stall. I've just got to be a bit conscious about <laughs> how uh, how much I'm spending. So let's go for a train cargo train station, and I'm just going to do the one for now with the intention of coming back and expanding later, which is absolutely fine. So we're got to think what we're, what we're taking here, and we are taking these machines. And I've, you've also got to bear in mind, you don't want to block your town in as well from growing, because if I build a whopping line along here along the side, with no roads to be able to pass under or over, you can kind of like stop your town from growing, because it becomes enclosed and has nowhere to expand to. So I need to bear that in mind as well when I'm when I'm building this. You know what, we'll go there though. We've got a pretty good catchment area there for the, the centre. So go on, just 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 plop it in, Steve. There we go, we're committed now. So we're off. We're getting a bit of a bit of a shake on with uh, this this line construction. So are you going to stop here like you said? In which case which way are you best sling so that sling it shotting past your station? Do I go here? Oh, this is going to be fun. <laughs> There's farm in the way, so I'm, I'm, I'm probably going to have to come down this way. Oh, that's a steep angle as well. Yeah, this, this probably wasn't the best idea, Steve. It's not ideal, but we'll we'll come up with a solution in the future. <laughs> we'll just see what happens. Oh, look at it. Oh, this terrain is not doing me any favours here. Will that be too tight of a corner? Build something like that there. Can you, can you, can you curve that? We've got a little bit of a tunnel going on there. I can live with a little bit of a tunnel. I, I, I don't like the massive tunnels like what I built early, earlier on in the series up in uh, between Manchester and Stoke. I, I don't like that tunnel. I'm going to have to go back and revisit it. It's too big. Half the map underground. So we'll put that like that. It's a little bit curvy, but... Oh, we've got three million now. Awesome. We can uh, progress. So... I'm going to have to hook a road up here. Which road do you want? I'd like a highway if that's okay. Apparently it's not okay. Let me change you back into... There we go. Connected. Cool. I might need to just do some adjustments with this station. Allow like trains to go the other way. Because I think we're going to need a lot of trains. And, and now I'm going to have to try and weave this track through by this farm. Which is in a really awkward spot. Come on. Come on. Can you go there? Yep. Might have to do a bit of editing on this road here. You're gonna throw up a hissy fit because you don't think, oh no, we're good. That's gonna be a nightmare to double track later on. Oh well, that, that's a later on problem, not a today problem. <laughs> and let's continue. Oh. oh, that's steep. That's a steep incline. Oh man, that's not gonna be good. Even that's pretty, pretty crazy. Right, how am I gonna, how am I gonna put this in, in such a way that do I do I lower it down a touch, like that? So we're going through this valley here to try and save on costs. I say we do something like that. 
then you can go from here and connect up to there. It's, it's not great, but you see how it's like sank it into the ground a little bit. Might might ease off the, the locomotive struggling too much. I really want some new trains. I need to get some new trains soon. And then we, trains with a little bit more a little bit more power behind them. So we'll build that like that. There we go. And connect this back in. Come on, you can Yep. Little bridge. Thank you. We, which bridge are we going for? Some, ooh, no, don't like that. Uh what about something like Gerda Bridge? Yeah, that, that's okay. We'll go for that. Can curve this round. And get it, get it connected. Uh, that's a bit. Can we raise you up to? Where's the cheapest? There we go. That's the cheapest one. And then obviously I need to connect my station up to it. So that's that plumbed in, and now we need to. This is going to need a lot. I think trying to do it a single track is going to um, not work out very well at all. But that that's not too expensive. I thought that was going to be a lot steeper and a lot more expensive than it is going to be. How far can I go before you start what to do? It's about there. Through here, to the other side. That's okay. I can live with a little tunnel. And I'm gonna want a little station somewhere around here. Like that. Well, that's not great, is it? Why is, why is it doing that little weird curve back again? Or is it just because the land dips down? Ah, it's the land, land dips down making it look like it's got a weird curve to it. Then, I'm going to have to go and build another station just here. We'll go something like... That's quite high up there, isn't it? Can we, can we, can we go down a bit? Is it, is it, come on. Yeah, no. Where, where, whereabouts are we? Zoom in a bit. Oh, that's too low. It's about right there, isn't it? Go for it. And that will need connecting on. And this is probably going to cost us a fortune. Where's the other? There. We'll go for that. We've got a nice long straight line there. And then I want to have... For now... I, you know what, I'm not going to put a terminus in because I think we're going to need to expand this in the future. So we'll just go with like a... A, a through station, just a one platform for now. It's very quickly going to need more than that I would have thought though. This is not going to make any money is it? Everyone's screaming at the screens going what are you doing? You, you, you're going too big too early. Well I, I kind of think it'd be fun to to have a go at doing multiple multiple industries. So are you funded? You're off. Right so that's connected. You're not connected, that's going to be connected in. 
little wiggle. Right, okay. I'm gonna get you. Uh, okay, cool. Yep. And you're not. connected you're connected so we need to find a way of getting this call over here do a oh. what's it going to be like if we do a the issue is that this this and I'm, I'm, I'm fairly certain the way this calculates is how long it takes to get from there to there. And unfortunately for us, um, we've got this giant mountain in the way, which is not ideal. So the only thing, we could potentially run it up here and down, or join onto this line, which is, is a potential option. We could tunnel straight through. Which I think is going to be quite costly. Uh, let's have a look and see what that's going to be. Well, it's, it's not the worst, but... Oh, there, there we go. There's the big bucks. <laughs> yeah. Not not what I'm looking for, really. And then you can go, go up this way. But that's going to... Again, you're getting tunnels and... It's going to be a bit roller coaster -y. How how cheap can we get from there to that? Yeah, it's, that's not too bad, I suppose. And it is flat. So then the question is, um, how steep is that going to there to that? That's not too bad, actually. Yeah, we'll go for that. So we'll, we'll build a, a line that runs under this mountain. I would like to use it for something else. Ideally. And also, I've got to connect this up to my uh, line in, in Leicester. So we're going to have to have a curve off here into Worcester. Then plummet in to Leicester as well, which I want to do before the end of this episode. And we're already 17 minutes in, with five minutes of me going, ooh, ooh well, yeah, let's go that way. No, let's not do that. <laughs> Unable to make a decision. Right, come on, you need to get a shake on if you're going to get all this done. Right, yep, yeah, I'm on it. I've got my engineering cap on. Uh, and, and also try not to run out of cash, which is the other dilemma. If we go about there, and then we curve, oh, that's actually cheaper than it was before, which is great. But we are coming up a bit high on this track here. You know what? Take it, it's cheap. You're not made of money at the moment. Uh, can I get that to wiggle off there and not look silly? Probably not. But I can probably do something like this. And then, if I do that, and then put that on there like that. And just give that a little bit of a... Yeah, that looks okay. I have a feeling this road's going to need to get built again. I'm going to need a big bridge over there. How many times can you rebuild a bridge in one episode? <laughs> right. Uh, mm, yeah. Uh, no. I'm not a fan of that. Let's... Uh, Terrain. I don't like doing terrain this early on. But I'm not. 
not having a very ugly bridge. Which is already very ugly. Well, there we go. That'll do. Um, what kind of bridge can we go for now? Oh, that's alright. We'll go for something like that. That'll do. And then we'll be back tomorrow to rebuild it again when I start adding more tracks in. So that coal train, that's literally just going to be running back and forth between here and here. I'm, I am going to need to put, this is going to need another platform, definitely. There's no way that's going to work without another platform, is it? And again here, because I'm going to have trains turning around. They haven't even built the station here yet. Right, well I have built the station, I haven't put the track in yet. Um, okay, right, come on. Get that plumbed in, you need to get that there. That has to go here, you know it has to go there. Otherwise this whole endeavour is pointless. Right, so that's in. This is a big line. <laughs> this is a massive line. Uh, right. Do I want to set my roots up now? Or do I want to leave it a minute? Uh, do I want to finish my line all the way to Leicester? This is going to be a good place to put a station in Worcester. That'll be... I need, I need to get that plumbed in. That, that The population size, that's quite a big... Quite a big uh, city there, but I'll I kind of want which which way do I go? Like do I go from Worcester to Birmingham to Leicester? Which probably how it would be in real life, <laughs> rather than going straight to Leicester. I don't really want to have to. I suppose it might be quite scenic coming around here and down through this valley. I did want to get Birmingham connected up. But, in reality, it probably makes more sense to go and, and wiggle through here for now, then add Birmingham at a later date. Because I've, I've got to spend a fortune on locomotives, yep. What are you going to do? Come on, let's just get building, rather than talking about it. Let's uh, chuck this in a completely stupid place. Can I get you to do that? And how much is that going to That's going to cost me a fortune. Right, you've done it anyway. And then get your single track <laughs> station there. You better get this plumbed in before they start building all around you, mate. Yeah, I know. They're, they're, they're eager. That's a little bit of a incline on there. And here. So, and there's not enough clearance. Is there enough clearance in there? You're not going to tell me. Come on. Give me a clue. Oh, what kind of bridge do we want? I can't take a look at that one. We'll go for we'll go for something a bit more metallic on that one, and then this road be routed to go underneath this bridge, and then you can connect onto there like so. Good, and the road before you forget that put back in. That. Something like that. Okay. Now, it's only a, a quick fix, and then I need to get. Where's that looking a bit more ghostly? Okay, pause the game because I, I just know they're going to surround me with the building, and then I'll have to pay to demolish buildings. I don't want to pay to demolish any buildings. Ideally, that looks a bit better now. 
but I've also got to get through here. Which is looking a bit like a barrel of laughs. Come on, how am I going to get that through there without... I think you're just going to have to demolish them, mate. There's no... You've got no alternative. Yeah, I don't really want to, though. Um, if you want to get this done, you've got to do it. You've got to commit and just press that build button. Okay, I'm on it. I do want to get this line connected up with the rest of my lines. I should have started at the other end, really. I, I kind of want everything to be connected. That's one of my things that I want in my railways. I want all my railways to be joined together. So, go there. Right, you're running out of cash. You better press the, uh, the play button there. A bit of time on the go. Let's build a... Uh, Oh, we've got a little, just a little bit of wood going in there. Yeah, I am, I'm literally about to run out of cash, so... <laughs> right, while we're waiting for a bit of extra money to come in, because I'm going to bring this in, curl that round, and plumb it into the station here. And then I'll probably extend the passenger service, which isn't doing very well from Leicester to Worcester, I think that'll do very, very well between these two towns, because they're both, well, Worcester's quite large, and they'll probably use it to go all the way up to Manchester. So I, I, I want to get that connected up and done. Then, yeah, so then I need to try and set these up in some kind of functional way. <laughs> so I'll, I'll set the lines up now, and we can add the locomotives a little bit later on. So it's lines, create new lines. Where do you want to go? I want to go to London, please. And then we're going to pick up the um, iron ore here. And we're going to take that to the steel mill. And we're going to take the steel to the machines place. And then you're going to pick up your machines, then you're going to come all the way back, and you're not going to stop at the steel mill, you're going to keep going all the way back to London. So that's okay. That's the first one done. So we'll call you uh, Train Cargo London Machines 1. So that's the first one. So that's going to go all the way up there and do and do that now. The second one is going to be actually I'm having ideas here of how we can get one train to train do a bit more than just this shuttle going between the two. So we're going to go here and then you're going to go to the, the steel mill, drop off here You um, you call, then you're gonna go pick up the wood. Then you're going to drop off the wood and change it into planks, and then you're gonna go here and, and change it into machines, and then go all the way back. Empty. Oh, I don't like that. Is there any coal up here? That'd be ideal. Got some coal. I oh, can ship over. No. No, no call. Okay, that'll have to do. I don't think that one's going to make much money, but that'll feed the other line, which hopefully will make plenty of cash. So we'll see how that one goes. So we'll call you Train Cargo. Um, what did we call you? One London. And uh, you, you're going to be um, call and planks and machines. I always tend to put a one and I don't know why, because like, it's a different name to the other one, but yeah, anywho. So that's set up. Come on, something's got to pay off soon. 
I want some money so I can finish me line. It's so close yet so far. I also need to think logistically how I'm going to need to uh, add um, passing loops at each of these stations from the trains. Ideally, I could do a double tracking. This shouldn't be too expensive to double track. So I could probably double track along here with very few issues. However, the tunnel's probably going to be quite expensive, so I might need to just single track into the tunnel for now, then double track it once we come out. Um, double tracking down here is going to be an absolute nightmare. <laughs> you should have thought about this before you built it. Well, I, I did. I did think about it. I said it wasn't a good idea. Yeah, you went and did it anyway. Oh, well. Progress. Come on, we've got to get some trains dropping off soon. Have you got a full load? You have got a full load. Come on, get your toe down. I want a bit of cash to get this last bit of line plumbed in. And then I can get that passenger service extended. How many trains do I have on that uh, Leicester passenger line? Everyone's making money at the moment, though, which is nice. Oh, that's what I like to see. Uh, where are you? Um, train, 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 train. Is that the one? Okay, so you're making a little bit of cash now. You've got 30 passengers on board. I think that when I extend it to Worcester, we're probably going to need another locomotive on that one. Oh, we're looking in leak now. Busy. You've got, you got plenty. Oh, yes. Right, well, I need some more carriages on those two trains soon. And how are we looking in Manchester? Ah, oh, really, very busy. We're doing well there, so we need to get need to get some more carriages on those trains. Right, we've got a bit of cash again. Let's get this line finished off. Come on, that way. Yeah, and then can you please just curl around there and connect up there? No. Not. Come on. You can do it. There we go. So that's in. That's going to need a little bit of work on it in a little bit, but at least it's connected. So now we've got a line that runs all the way. Technically now we've got a line that runs from Manchester to London, albeit a little bit all over the place. I don't think I'm going to bring passengers down this way. Well, if I do, they'll be going elsewhere. I don't think they're going to come into London this way. I, I do want to build a, lot, a direct line that goes down from Leicester to Birmingham to London. So we'll, we'll, we'll cross that bridge when we get to it, but that's not for this episode. What is for this episode is getting some train set up, and I'm still not sure how I'm going to go about doing it. <laughs> like, this this is going to be a bottleneck here. But, but, and this needs... This is going to need something before we even start running trains on it. Because that is never going to work with just the two tracks like that. And I've only just built it. I haven't even run a train on it. I just know it's not going to work. It's not going to hold up to the, the amount of traffic that it's going to have to take. So, uh, what do I build? Could do with a, another depot down this way. I've got two million in the bank again now, though, which is nice. Um, let's put in a depot over here. There you go. You're probably not going to need any more platforms but what you're doing soon. That'll probably work out okay there. Right. You know what? Just... Nah, don't, 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 don't. I was going to just put the trains on and go for it. I know this is going to be a problem so I need to sort this out. So let's get the bulldozer tool. Right. Let's go. You're thinking, what's he doing? Why is he adding all these different platforms and all 
these tracks. There is, there is a method in the madness of what I've done there. The trains can now pass through without stopping because this train that's coming up here is going to want to go uh, into this platform every time. The train coming up here is going to want to go into a platform every time. So, um, I'll, I'll fire back that gun again. That's alright. Come on, let me click it. There we go. And you're going to go to the collision now. There we go, that's it. It's not happy with that. How do I want this to go? that in like that. Let's put two tracks going to that. Uh, and you're gonna want to go over here. Like that. Uh, this is gonna be a pain. Into there like that. Um, you're gonna want to go like that. Oh, this is getting a bit complicated now. You're going like that. It's a bit slow, but I mean, Steve, you don't need to make it that tight. Just use your bulldozer tool. Take it back a bit. Plumb that in like that. A little bit faster for the trains then. And then signals, yep, we need them. I'm gonna put them in then. Uh, well, I like to live dangerously. Oh, you're gonna have to put some signals in. Uh, it's just gonna be a mess of trains getting stuck there if you don't. Yeah, I know. I'll, I'll, I'll get around to it. I'm just gonna carry on with getting my junction sorted first. Okay, that's fine. You know what? It's like if you'd thought about this before you started doing it, you would have realised you had a problem. You could have sorted it before building it all. Yeah. Hindsight is a wonderful thing. Right, so let's get that in there, you in there, and then I'm going to build a basic just crossover to make sure my trains can go from one side to the other. It's not the best for throughput, but it's better than what I had. Um, this bridge is probably going to have to get demolished for a third time, but we'll see. Um, let's Open you out like that. We'll try and keep the speed up, even though the trains don't go that fast in this uh, stage of the game. There we go. So that's sorted. Um, right, what are you going to do here? <laughs> the station's on the wrong side. Yeah, I know. I know. What have I done that for? Well, what's happened there? Uh, nice. What am I going to do here? Answers on the postcard. <sighs> it's, come on. So my trains are going to want to switch over to the wrong side of the track. Near enough every time you stop at these stations, so I'm going to have to build like a bypass loop around. Well, you can start with doing a bit of double track there. Bring that down here and take that off there. 
No, you're not. You're not happy with that one. There we go. And then that's kind of done, ready. And it, and it doesn't look very good. You know what? Abandon that for now. That's not important. Well, it is important, but it's not important right now. Yeah, you need to go down this way. Well, I need, I need to. <laughs> oh man, what am I, what am I creating here? It's a, an abomination. That's what it is. Let's just double track you all the way. We'll get it done now, because you, you're just gonna have trains stuck everywhere. And then we'll build that like that. And that like that. Oh, right. And... <laughs> oh, what am I doing? I think... You know what? Let's... Take a moment and have a think about what you're making before you start committing to it. It's a waste of cash now. We'll build that like that. Yep. And then we're going to build this out here like this. Yep. And then you've got to double track this all the way. Which hopefully won't cost too much. He says it goes to 1.4. That, 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 that's a glitch. That's why that's done that. Split it up into small sections. Yep, and then build you across there. Uh, ah, yep, and then you want to go to here like that. Yep. Then you have to go to that. Yep, that's fine. And I'm going to build a kind of a, a bit of a bit of a slingshot over there. Being like, no, I don't want to do that. And yeah, you're gonna. Can we... Can we do that? Yeah, there we go. This is not an efficient way of building. <laughs> it, the thing I should do is just build a platform on the other side, and that would kind of like make it all work quite nicely. But I suppose in in the the real world that. These kind of things happen where they switch over like this, so I guess it's kind of kind of okay. Gonna have to be careful with my signaling on on the I think that's the best way to do it without having to demolish it again. Because I don't want to demolish it again. Send you through that way, and then you're gonna go like that. Oh, hang on, a bit of an issue there. But, um, we'll go like that, and then I'll just have to rebuild that last little bit. And you're going over there like that. Oh, this is not going to work out very well. Let's go like that. Yep, yeah, I mean, we can have that as just like a little side in. We'll put some like uh, carriages there in the future. And now I want to get. This is the slowest construction project I've ever done. Thinking too big, that's the issue. And then auto save decides, yep, yeah, now is the time to uh, to save the game. Um, let's put you like that, and then you're going like that. This is probably going to need another station very, very quickly. Um, so I wanted to remake this junction, so... No, 
that's a bit of a, a bonus. It does look hideous that. It's okay, we can we can fix it. We'll just do Oh, it's not, it's not happy at all, is it? It's not enjoying that. We can kind of do something like that, I think. And we can do something like that. And we can take that back a bit. Connect that back on. How's that? Much better. Is it still okay? Yeah, that's alright, I can live with that. And then that, that can just be like that for now. And, right, signaling. This is going to be a bit complicated now. So I want a signal here before here. And I'm going to want one there, and I'm going to want one there. There's enough space there for that to wait out. That one is not being used at the moment anyway, but I'll have to come back to that in the future. I'm going to want to have a signal there. A signal there. Ooh, a bit of a dangerous game putting one there, but I think we're going to need one there. And then we're going to need another one here. And here, like that, yep, that's fine. And same again on this side, so one there, and one before it goes out, and I'm going to one just here, and one just here, and I'm going to want another one just here. This is a big stretch, so I think I'm going to need in the middle on of a set of signals just like that. Um, probably going to want to set a signal going into the station so that can wait just outside. And then by the tunnel, we've got one there. A couple there like that, and one to stop the trains from going in. And oh, I don't want you. One just here before the point, and oh gosh, what's happened there? Oh, <laughs> I don't like that. Oh, I was like, I thought I'd got this sorted. Let's do something like Can I build another track for that? Yeah. Can you join on for one? Just have a wiggle over there. Not the best, but that works. So something like that, and then we'll build a track across like that. Cool, yeah. And a signal just here for that track. Yeah, that looks good. Are you going the whole way now, Steve? Well, you know, I've started, haven't I? So, this is becoming quite a big, big endeavour. I might as well. I've started, so I'll finish. Oh, I don't like that. I oh, have to come back and... Yeah, I don't like that. Right. We can, we'll find a solution for that. To be fair, it doesn't really need to go across the track there anyway. We can just join this up here and it'll still do the same thing. 
Swing across here like that. Let me try and try to be fancy here. Put a signal there. Might as well just rebuild the whole thing. And put that like that. And I think we're almost back to uh, London now, so that, that's good. And my lines are all broken, so I'm going to have to try and fix those. Come on. There we go. Signal, yep. Yeah. One of them here, please. And we'll have one just before you go into the tunnel. Hello. And then I'm going to need to wiggle this out with here to go. Oh, I had a feeling that might happen. Right. Wiggle. Wiggle. There we go. That's in there. The road. There we go, that's in. And then yeah. back into here, signals. Put one there like that. I think we're okay there now. But I need to work out why why are you not why are you not happy? Because you can't get to that platform over there, is it? You're right, you can't get to that platform over there. I've, I've completely blocked that off, haven't I? Right, so let's do a little bit of a tweak here. Oh, this is going to be ugly enough. Swing that over there like that and add in a double switch so that'll allow the train to either go down this track or that track and also you want to add the signal there now the question is can the returning train get back over um, I will just add a another little track there so if it does come in that platform it can squeeze over to the other side this is not efficient at all this will need redoing again but i know i've already redone it four times but uh <laughs> it's gonna need a, a revisit at a later time just to get that that working properly so that's all connected how are my lines doing so we've got that one there this brown one here, that seems to be okay going up there and then it it's coming up here and switching over to pick up yeah and then yeah I think we're good there so um, let's get some trains added well, I think that'll be us for this one so let's uh, add that and we want how many of those do we want I reckon about about that many will do. And you are on. Um, we'll put you on the green one for now. And then as soon as we get payday, we'll swap that back again. That's not going to make any money on this first run, but yeah, it has activated. We've got the iron ore being dropped off at the station down here. 
I probably want to reverse that. I think that's going to want to go all the way up to. Um, you go in here, and then I hope that reverses around. We'll find out in a little bit. And then once we've had some uh, vehicles do a few deliveries, we should be able to add the second train, which is going to go uh, from this coal mine here and start taking stuff to the steel mill and to the machine, so then back to back down here to London. So hopefully that's going to make us a nice little bit of, bit of cash there. I've got a lot of signals. I've got a bit overkill really for this early on, but I, I do think this is going to be a very busy line with the amount of different types of industry that we're, we're picking up from and taking to. That's going to really you know, it's going to need that capacity there to have lots of trains running on the same bits of track at the same time. So I think that having the amount of signals is probably about right at the moment, especially on this corridor here where we're going to have a lot of trains crossing over tracks and trains stopping and starting, which isn't ideal because when a train stopped, it's obviously not making you any money. But it is what it is. You see the train come out of the tunnel. Ah, there we go. Wonderful. That's amazing. So the waiting game now is there a boat coming I keep looking for my boats because they seem to pay out the best out of everything at the moment the boats drop off one load and like ah you're about to arrive oh splendid once that arrives we'll have uh, plenty of cash to get that second train on the go and then uh, that'll be it for, for this episode Come on, Boat, you can do it. Right, we can get that other train on the go. So, we are going to here, here. No, we're not. Where's my other train gone? Where are you? Need you to about turn. Oh, you're not going to, are you? Oh, boy. I'll, I'll, I'll add a sneaky bit of tracking. Oh, no, I haven't got space, have I? Ooh. Wait. Ah oh, no, I'm not doing that. That looks shocking. Go on, on you go. But I do want to go on here. Click on that train, manage vehicle, or copy it. Get a second one on the go. But you are going to go to... You're changing the line to that one. So that train will now... Oh. It should be departing. Why are you not? Are you going? Are you just. Are you moving? Why are you stuck there? You're waiting for a free path. There is a free path, isn't there? Ah, oh, okay, right. How about now? Now it's clear at the station. on its way so yeah there we go we've got um, multiple industries being connected so we're going to be delivering uh, machines into London hopefully London's going to grow um, I think the next step 
is going to be getting the passenger service into Worcester and of course passenger service into Birmingham uh, which will be coming down uh, through uh, Leicester so Manchester with a staff in Manchester to Leicester to Birmingham to London and that's going to be a really big uh, main line so when I'm building this stretch I'm going to be wanting to keep it as flat and straight and as possible thinking of the future of uh, the trains that I'm going to be running on there um, but we'll see how that goes so yeah if you've enjoyed the episode please give me a, a like and if you uh, haven't subscribed feel free to subscribe and I'll see you in the next episode